to San Antonio. Get ready for a special evening where business and community come together. It's the 34th annual induction dinner of the Texas Business Hall of Fame. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the podium the chairman of the Texas Business Hall of Fame, Kirk McDonald. So good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Texas Business Hall of Fame's 34th annual induction dinner. Well, I think the Texas Business Hall of Fame is to recognize top business leaders in the state of Texas and for what they have contributed to the community. I think the other big part is, is to sort of recognize those who we think might be the next generation of Texas Business Hall of Fame recipients, and that is uh, business school students around the state. Texas Business Hall of Fame pick the best and the brightest from every campus and acknowledge them as a potential Texas business legend down the road. This year, we we're able to award 36 scholarships. Each individual was awarded a scholarship of $15,000. Please join me in congratulating each of them. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, please recognize our Texas Business Hall of Fame 2016 business legends and all of the members of the Texas Business Hall of Fame. Our first award of the evening is to Warren Buffett and Charles Munger. Charlie and I are like the managers of a great baseball team. We've got a great lineup of our managers. We're not there to tell them how to bat. Testing, one million, two million. What the hell, this is Texas. One billion, two billion. Well, I'm very glad to live here because I once lived in San Antonio. I was a second lieutenant at Kelly Field. This is for you. And now, Charles E. Cheever, Jr. We weren't really striving to be the most profitable bank or anything like that. We just wanted to take care of the customer and our employees. They told me they weren't going to give me my plaque until I made a few comments. And to tell you the truth, <laughs> I'm a smart enough guy to, when I follow that, that combination from Omaha, <laughs> I'm not going to try. I just want to thank everybody for coming. And the next story we will watch is the story of Gordon V. Hartman. Morgan's Wonderland is not about selling tickets. It's about offering a service to those who have special needs uh, without barriers. It's not overly magical, but it did. There is a lot of magic that occurs here. I am honored tonight, ladies and gentlemen, to be part of this select group of 185 individuals who, since 1982, have come before me with this honor. Our next honoree, please join me as we watch the story of Gary C. Kelly. Southwest um, was a maverick from the beginning, very entrepreneurial. So that spirit uh, was there uh, and remains to this day. This is uh, just a unbelievable honor uh, for me. It is uh, just a wonderful experience to have shared Southwest Airlines for all these many years. Uh, our next business legend is Diane Graves Stye. One thing that was very important to me, along with developing the people of Owen Healthcare, I wanted them to know that they weren't there counting pills. They were healing people. I think work has to have a higher purpose. First of all, I want to thank each one of you in attendance tonight and participating in this absolutely fantastic gala event. It's a uh, special pleasure to draw your attention to the story of our next business legend, Dennard O. Ware. I've always thought that the better you model a business opportunity, the better off you are. It's like playing a Sudoku game. It's going to go together one way or essentially one way and you got to get it right. And I would like to thank the Texas Business Hall of Fame Foundation for granting me this most humbling honor. So wasn't that wonderful? That's a great class. We're very blessed with this class coming in for 2016. Uh, and now I've got one more thing to do, and I'm pleased to uh, introduce the incoming chairman of the Texas Business Hall of Fame for 2017 from Dallas, Jason Signal. 
As a past scholarship recipient, Native Texan, I'm really honored to be chosen to lead this organization next year and look forward to Dallas, Texas. So thank you for coming. Good night and God bless Texas.